Hello, boys and girls. Today we're going to read a story called The Crocodile and the Dentist by Taro Gomi. What do you think Taro Gomi's job is? He's the only name that I see on the front of this book. So I think his job is to write the book. So he's the author and to draw the pictures. That means he's the author and the illustrator. Boys and girls, what do you call this part of the book? You're right, this is the front cover. All right, let's check this part out. What do you call this? That's right, you do a good job. That is the spine. All right, one more question. What do you call this part of the book? The back cover, good job. Boys and girls, when you open a book, Usually the first page that you see is the title page. So this is the title page for this book. All right, now let's begin. I really don't want to see him. Who do you think he's talking about when he says that he doesn't want to see them? Look at his face. You're right. I think it's the dentist. He doesn't want to see the dentist. Let's read on the to see what happens. But I must. Right, the sign says the dental office. He's going to see the dentist. You're right. I really don't want to see him, but I must. Who do you think this person is? You're right. That's the dentist. Shall I go through with it? Shall I go through with it? I must be brave. I must be brave. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm ready for the worst. I'm ready for the worst. think he did. I think he pinched him. What an awful thing to do. Look, boys and girls, he's holding his face. What do you think he did? He's probably getting a cavity filled. What an awful thing to do. And look at the dentist. He's holding his arm. He must hurt his arm. But getting angry won't help. But getting angry won't help. It's not much longer. Not much longer. If he's filling his tooth in. I think they're both exhausted. Thank you so much. See you again next year. Thank you so much. See you again next year. I really don't want to see him next year. I really don't want to see him next year. So I must never forget to brush my teeth. So you must never forget to brush your teeth. All right, boys and girls. Thank you for listening for your assignment. We want you to compose a narrative writing piece using the words first, next, and last for the crocodile and the dentist. Before we go, I want to ask you a few questions to get you ready for your writing. Where was the setting? If you said the dentist's office, you're right. The setting was at the dentist's office. Who are the characters in this book? There were only two. The crocodile and the dentist. 
What would you think the conflict was in this book? I think the conflict was that he had a toothache and he was afraid to go to the dentist to get his tooth filled. And the dentist was afraid of him too. Thank you for listening, boys and girls. I really enjoyed reading you this book. Have a good day.